Hey everybody, my name is Sheila and I'm a paparazzi consultant. So if you're watching this video, you probably just joined paparazzi and you're wondering, what do I do next? So although I made this video specifically for my team because this is the email I send out to them when they join, uh, it really, it works for anyone who's just signed up. All the information is very useful and I hope it helps you. So here's the beginning of it. Your first step, you picked out your kit, you purchased it, what do you do next? After that, I personally add all my new team members to a few Facebook groups that I'm in with uh, my other team. Uh, you know, my upline, sideline, <laughs> downline. We all work together, help each other with tips. Uh, they do supportive lives. Uh, we do giveaways. Just lots of helpful stuff. I highly suggest adding your team members to these groups if you have them. And if you're just joining, ask your upline if there are groups. They're very helpful. Step three. I'm sorry, I should have put my phone on silent. Uh, step three, create a, biz a Facebook business page and a VIP group page. Now these are very important in my opinion. Now some people will go live from their personal profile, but not only is that against Facebook regulations and they can delete your profile. I have way too many precious pictures on my profile to be deleted. Also, anybody who watches your live, you know, if they share it with anyone, they won't be able to comment unless they're on your friends list most of the time. So you are losing profit there. You're losing potential customers. They get annoyed that they can't comment. They try messaging you during the live sometimes and you don't answer and you would have to friend everyone in the whole world so they can shop from you. It's just, it's not a good thing. Now, the reason you make a, biz a business page and a group page is because you have to go live from your business page. If you go live from your VIP group, only members will be able to comment. So, you have to have a business page and a group page. Now, the business page, when you go live from it, anyone can see it. It's completely public. People could share it, new people could drop in, and then they comment right away, and buy, and shop. It's perfect. So, if you have any questions there, go ahead and comment down below, and I'll help you out. So, moving on, uh, you should make business cards. Now, at first I debated this, but it is extremely helpful. Even though everything's still online, people still use business cards. So get some printed out. I highly suggest this to print. They do really good with this. Uh, they guarantee your business cards to be exactly like you want or you get your money back or a free replacement. And they're very inexpensive. They usually have a promo running where you can get 100 business cards for only $10. So again, I highly suggest them. Uh, the next step I said to, is to wait for your kit. Uh, <laughs> and also I suggest purchasing items that you might want to start your sales, uh, I highly suggest to not just use your starter kit. As soon as you sign up and your starter kit's ordered, you are free to start ordering from that website. So start ordering right away is my suggestion, you don't have to. Uh, build up that inventory and remember the cutest items will sell out within 10 minutes. So <laughs> I highly suggest checking that website every day, Monday through Friday, when the new items come out around noon. Uh, highly suggest that <laughs> you want to get those hot items fast get them fast because everybody else will snag them up you don't want to miss out you don't want to wait for your kit and miss out um. <laughs> next uh, step six I said to pick out your color theme now in my opinion this is important for identity I know a lot of consultants use the colors pink and black because that's paparazzi's colors I personally wanted to stand out, so I use purple and teal. Well, it's like a bluish, like a light blue teal. Um, you're going to have to have a color for your bubble mailers to melt your jewelry, and you're going to have to have a color for your jewelry bags, you know, your little organza bags uh, to put your jewelry in. Which, you don't have to get the cute little bags, but believe me, you will make your customers happy when they're just so cute. They love how it's packaged. Some of them love when you put them in jewelry bags because they gift them out and these bags are super super cheap like less than 10 cents each bag it's super worth it <laughs> anyways that's where you see here packaging for your customers i put a few examples here where you can see the prices of the bags and everything 
I only pay like five dollars for a hundred of my cute little baggies and they have cute little silver butterflies on them which again I've had so many customers say oh I love your little baggies so they come back for more and more and more it sets you apart from other consultants so I highly suggest getting really cute bags spend that few extra cents if it has a little cute decoration on it anyways moving on here I gave some example of the bubble mailers I personally buy the 250 pack for $38 uh, you save a lot more money <laughs> in the long run, um, so I buy a bulk personally. I know it's a lot more out of pocket right now, but believe me, it will save you a lot of money in the end. You will get out of state customers, a lot of them, once you get high up there and get your name out there. So again, I highly suggest in investing in bulk order items. Displaying your jewelry for live sales and more. Now, while you it's perfectly fine to sit on your couch and pull up one jewelry item at a time, I highly suggest setting up a pegboard behind you so that when after you show an item, you can hang it up on the pegboard right behind you and customers can see. And maybe they dropped in 20 minutes into the live sale already. They're gonna see a beautiful blue item behind you, a green item. And they're like, oh, can you please reshow that necklace that wasn't here? There you go, you would have missed out on that sale if you were just sitting on cash and you put it below you and they couldn't see. So, it's just a suggestion, not a requirement. Plenty of consultants sell off their couch and they just show one item at a time and they still make sales. This is just a little boost if you want it. Let's see, next, over here I gave the details on how paparazzi will release 10 new items every business day, Monday through Friday. Now, my time, I'm Pacific time, so I know to watch out for it between 12 p.m. and 4 p.m. So you'll have to adjust that to your time zone. So they will release 10 new items and it will stay in the new items until it's sold out. Now remember, the really cute stuff will sell out, boom, like that. Seriously. Really cute hoop earrings came out the other week and I tried so hard. I was refreshing the site like crazy. I was on top of it. As soon as it came out, I hurry up and added it to my cart and I'm like, oh crap, I want free shipping so I gotta add 100 items, or you know, 100 items, $100. <laughs> so I kept adding, I kept scrolling, finding other stuff I want to add, hurry up, uh, this was all in five minutes. Add it to my cart, click checkout, hoop earrings were already sold out. I was just, they sold out within 10 minutes. I was just, I was so frustrated. <laughs> Anyways, you got to be quick on those cute items, so just keep an eye out. The high demand items will sell out very fast. Keep refreshing that site and keep an eye out every day. Uh, as what I do personally is I will check it every day, adding a couple items here and there that I really want in my inventory or I think are cute. I'll just keep adding to my cart because you know you get free shipping after you reach $100. So I will just keep adding and the next day keep adding and then when you finally see that item that you know is going to sell out, it's super cute you don't want to miss out on it, you check out. So you'll have like a few days of a shopping cart built up and then you'll check out as soon as that cute item <laughs> shows. Do not miss it guys. Um, rules to watch out for. These are very important rules that I have come across and everyone should know them. Okay, so rule number one, you cannot wear the jewelry and then sell it. So in other words, don't <laughs> put on a necklace for the whole life sale or a ring or anything really and wait you know and show it and say hey this is for sale and then keep it on the whole life sale that is very unacceptable to paparazzi they will cancel you for that so don't do it it's just not worth it yes I know a few consultants a lot of consultants <laughs> have been doing it and other consultants have been complaining about it you can get reported so just don't risk it uh, you're, yes, you can slip it on your finger really quick just to show how it would look and look, oh, that's beautiful, but then take it off and move on to the next item. Uh, number two, when using the paparazzi logo with pictures and such, make sure they are compliant. Now, this is a big one because you can get reported for this as well. Now, I don't think they would cancel you right away if you didn't know, but, you know, a lot of us like to use uh, Facebook pictures and we share them that has the paparazzi logo on it. Well, Paparazzi recently uh, changed their lo logo from uh, the copyright, from TM to R. So on that right side, on the bottom, middle, wherever, where you see the copyright little thing, make sure it does not say TM or you cannot use it. It has to say the R with a circle around it. Okay, next one. 
You cannot buy or sell paparazzi jewelry for less or more than five dollars unless buying from the paparazzi website itself. Now I recently found out that you technically can sell it for more than five, it's just really really frowned on. But buying or selling it for under five dollars is a huge rule breaker and yes they will cancel your uh, consultant ID for that. So don't do it, don't risk it, it's not worth it. Never sell it for under five dollars and never go looking for it for under five dollars and don't buy it for under five dollars. It's just, I'm trying to keep you safe you guys. Uh, next, you are free to do giveaways and such for your live sales but you cannot give away anything that is not paparazzi. Uh, most, most people give away one free item at random. That's the reason that paparazzi will give you the hostess rewards. That's another thing when ordering. Paparazzi will give you one free jewelry piece for every 10 items that you order in your cart. So really try to order in increments of 10. Okay, back to this one. Uh, you cannot require a purchase to be necessary to get in the giveaway when you do giveaways, so make sure you do that. It has to be open to all your viewers and customers. You cannot restrict in your giveaways. Everyone has to be eligible whether they made a purchase or not. Now you can require that they be on the live sale when you announce the winner. A lot of people will do that, which is a good little trick, you know, to make sure they stick around to the end. So, uh, back to you cannot give away anything that's not paparazzi. <laughs> uh, many of us didn't know in the beginning and we liked to give away makeup or like a jewelry box or, you know, just little things that aren't paparazzi, which we thought was okay. But apparently, <laughs> you are not allowed to give it anything away except for a piece of paparazzi jewelry. It has to be paparazzi. I think they have other things in the back office that you could buy to give away, but it has to be paparazzi. You cannot give away any other brand or company of anything. No jewelry, no makeup, nothing that is not paparazzi. So that's a very important rule so that you don't get reported. And the last rule, remember to have respect for your fellow consultants, do not go onto their lives and mention your business to their customers. This is a big no-no. If they want to mention that you sell or also sell paparazzi, then they can do so, but do not try to steal other consultants' customers. Now this is very important. I know a lot of times if you just join paparazzi, you are probably buying from your uh, consultant that you joined under. But please do not go on their lives and say, hey, I also sell that, hey, I also have that, you know, I have that in a different color, I have that in different amounts. That is extremely rude. Please don't go on their live announcing that you also sell paparazzi. Now, if that consultant wants to say, hey, look, this person here, you know, just signed up, you guys should check them out too, you know. Some consultants will try to help their downline like that and they'll announce it and try to push customers their way, but if they don't say it, uh, that's that. Please don't try to take the customers. It's very weird. Uh, if you have any questions on that, again, just comment down below. Um, and that's it. That's what I said. That's all, folks. <laughs> again, you don't need to purchase everything I did. I did purchase a lot. I'm going to take this business all the way. So if you have the funds and the means and the passion, go for it. Buy everything like I did. We will get there. But you really don't need all this other stuff. It's just comfort items. It makes you feel comfort and confident and that's what I needed. Hopefully if you can't afford all that, you could be confident without it. Just be yourself, be strong, be very positive during your lives. Always smile. Act like there's a lot of people in your lives. Okay, and that's it. This would be my email and my phone number if you need to text me. If you have any questions at all, And I will do another video. I don't want this one to be too long, so I'll do another video after this about the back office. So thank you again, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe. If you're my team, say hi down below. Thanks, guys. I'll catch you later. Bye.